Hello, this is Damaduck82, and uh, we're back for episode 43. I uh, just wanted to start off with uh, showing you guys some chips that I made here recently. I plan on bringing uh, both of them into the campaign eventually. I'll probably bring the bigger one in first. Um, she is uh, basically inspired by a uh, dreadnought. Um, 1800 millimeter crams. And it's got these uh, roughly 1500 millimeter secondaries and it just covered with tons and tons of the twin barrel secondary cannons. Uh, we got some light AA in the form of these guns right here that just use a tide flak round. Uh, cool thing about this is um, this boat will easily solo a bulwark and it's got no shields and no lamps. Been very proud of this design. Took me a while to get the aesthetics too. I think it looks amazing. And yes, that is uh, a hand flipping the bird on the little crests on the side there. I thought it was funny. Anyway, uh, we have here the uh, a laser cruiser that I made. Uh, I believe it's a Sun Tzu laser cruiser. Yes. Um, this thing, it's going to help us a lot with uh, trying to shoot down uh, those really fast vehicles. Because, yeah, the, when uh, I was going up against that Tachyon, yeah, the missiles were doing a good job, but uh, I think this could easily uh, help us turn the tide with things a little bit better. And uh, in case you all were wondering what the name was on uh, the uh, larger ship here, the Dreadnought, uh, it's uh, All Guns Blazing. I figured it was an appropriate name because it just got it's got stupid amounts of DAC on it. The secondary guns, those thing or the uh, the twin um, casemate guns, they've been doing a lot of good work. So yeah. Um, I'm not quite sure when I'm going to get to a point where I'm going to spawn that in, but um, I think I might attach it to the southern force because um, it's most closest to Lightning Hood's territory. So, yeah. Anyway, um, let's get back into the campaign. I think the Dreadnought is going to be spawned in on the Northern Force. Yeah. So I got rid of the uh, Shiryama, I mean not the Shiryamas, but um, the, uh, the White Deaths. I just think that uh, the targets we're up against right now are probably way too fast for them and we could probably uh, have the resources better spent on something else. I don't know if you saw during the last video, but uh, it just kind of sped on. Alright, one of those um, Tachyon just vaporized it with like one shot from its lasers and it just sped on by like nothing happened. Yeah, so. Let's get in an all guns blazing dreadnought. Now, you're probably thinking, why use a cram vessel against um, stuff like the white flares? Well, you would be amazed at what crams can do at short range. And uh, if they're trying to ram you, well, it just makes that range that much shorter, doesn't it? Alright, so we're going to pull all. And we're going to start repairs on the all guns blazing. Uh, you know what? I think I'm going to try something else as well. I want to try using a couple of these melee torpedoes. Just for fun. Okay. 
Now then, let's see here. Uh... I'm wondering if we could handle this 200 strength tile up here. I think we can. I think the metal militia could probably go up there and handle it fairly well. Now let's see here. I think I want to send Steel Division up here. Moving out. Moving out. We're going to send this fleet up here as backup. I want to try knocking out this tile real quick. Uh, let's see here. How are we coming on? Yeah, all guns blazing is at 30%. Very nice. Let's just speed it up just a little bit. Receiving. Receiving. Moving now. Receiving. Listening. All right. Let's see what uh, comes in this force here. Oh. Moving out. Well, that's kind of. We accidentally pulled two of them. Let's devour, guillotine, spike, spike. That doesn't seem too bad. I think our Air Force could probably handle this fleet over here, though. Uh, we're going to pull you guys back, though. And Air Force, yeah. Come over this way. I don't know how that just magically spun out of its ass, but hmm. guess we'll make do. And I think, yeah, we want, uh, we definitely want a Shiryama in that fleet. And we want the Aces in Exile to be in there. The submarines. But we want Shiryama at the top. Alright. Uh, I think I'll spawn on the Shiryama. Oh wait, I just realized something. Cancel. These guys are probably, yep, they're in the water. Okay, uh, we're good this time. Uh, what's... Okay, those are submarines. Yeah, they should be fine. Okay, let's do this again.
devourer is getting devoured by missile swarms. Very nice. At some point, I think I'd like to make a heavier version of a, a fighter plane. Very high speed one. I'm not quite sure what these spikes are supposed to be, but they don't seem that dangerous. Yeah, that devourer is dead. Looks like the spikes are gone. Very nice. That must be the guillotine. We got some pretty good missile hits on it. Very nice. couple of big high explosive missiles. I think the game had a chance to render the explosions. Yep, it's dead. Boom, daka daka. Try to get some repairs in. Alright, so what's in this fleet? Longinius, Valkyrie, Valkyrie, Judgment, Desecrator, Zealot. Let's see here, how are we doing over here? Moving out. Moving out. Okay. Are we repaired down here? Up the hell we are. Alright, metal militia.
Yep, I think I like that lineup. Wait, did I mess, mess up the aircraft again? Yes, I did. Let's try that again. Ah, and I keep forgetting about the... yeah. I'm sorry. Oh well. I just keep getting distracted. More blood shots coming in. Engaging now. Come on, kill him. Got one. Very nice. All right. Now we want to target this. Oh, do we got martyrs out there? I think we do. Yep. Engaging now. And that's why we have secondary guns. Boom, daka daka. Now. 
Oh, we got another one coming in. Here we go. Popped him like a grape. Is that a Longinius coming at us? So we need to target that. Uh, yeah. Ooh, this could be bad. Come on, attack him! Yep. That was not good. I think I got some issues going on with the local weapon controller, that's why that happened. Come on. Yeah, make them blocks disappear. I thought I saw a martyr out of the corner of my eye there. Uh, just target what I need you to target for fuck's sake. There we go.
I don't know if it was trying to come in for a ram or not, but I'm glad it missed. All right, we knocked that out. And your AI dead. Very nice. Come on, we just need to get a few good volleys in. Looks like we're getting some torpedo strikes. Very good. That's a crazy looking turret right there. That's high explosive torpedoes just chewing through that armor. Very nice. Receiving. Okay, I think we're going to pull that one for right now because I'm going to need faster units to take out what's coming up next.
I saw that zealot. Nah. I was thinking that the fighters would probably do better against it. Oh yeah, and that uh, guy Mira. Looks like they're all trying to hit this uh, cram bomber here. That's not going to quite hit. Oh yeah, the fighters are just tearing that guy Mira apart. Looks like we have uh, one of the cram bombers coming in for a run. I'm not quite sure who he's targeting. Probably going to be this guy right here. The zealot. Yep. Uh, it's gonna be close. Yep, I think it got it. Yep, it really got it. Uh, Gymera got taken out. Very nice. So the fighters are probably going to focus these guys down. Oh, you're about to eat a big torpedo. These judgments, they've been pissing me off because they got this huge torpedo span that comes out of here. Torpedoes are my weapons! Uh, looks like the zealot's down. Oof. This thing's eating some huge torpedoes. I mean, look at that. Oh, health below 80%. Very nice. Probably gonna have to call it a video after this one. It's kind of rain a little long. like 10 minutes too long yeah that guy's had it I probably should have thought a little bit more about uh, taking on that strike 200 tile 
before like the video had like 10 minutes left in it. Mm. My apologies for that. Honestly, had no idea what was going to spawn in or how long it was going to take, so yeah. Alright, that judgment is down. And we have won this battle. So let's go ahead and pull all once again. And uh, we'll call this one a video. I'd like to thank you all for watching. This has been Damodoc82. Uh, Y'all have yourselves a hell of a day. And uh, keep your hammer high. Later.